So there may be a time if you're a content creator where you need to record your phone, but the only problem is iPhone actually records in low quality and low bitrate. But lucky for you guys, I'm going to be checking out a software called Mirror 2, and it allows you to mirror the screen of your phone directly onto your computer, allowing you to record and capture that video. Massive shout out to the people over at iMyPhone for actually allowing me to check this out for you guys. And let's get right into it. All right, so just before I actually showed you the software itself, I wanted to show you what the product page actually looked like and just go over some of the main features of the product just so you know which one's the right page. Uh, this is gonna be the first link in the description just so you guys are 100% aware. Uh, so for example, it works with iOS and Android devices. It allows you to actually control your iPhone and Android screen with your computer mouse and keyboard, which is super cool. You're able to play your mobile games directly on your PC screen. You're able to stream in-app displays and audio to conferencing software. So if you needed to show something on your phone during a meeting or something like that this is great software to do that and you're also able to fast transfer files from pc to android devices so that doesn't work on ios it does work for android so if you do have an android device you are in luck and it just shows slight examples right here of what a game looks like on the computer that's being played on uh, iphone here for example or android i'm not sure what that phone is um, and it shows just different gaming examples and then it shows examples for live streaming meeting teaching demonstration etc and yeah it just pretty much it shows all of these different things right here these are just the basic features again if you want to look at this in depth first link in the description for you guys to actually check that out but this is what the software actually looks like once we have it installed it has these instructions you can either connect it via wi-fi or usb which is a great feature you don't have to directly have it plugged in but if you want less of a delay usb is the best way to go so for the sake of this video i'm going to be actually using a usb connection so i'm going to actually do this all right so for example i got my phone up and working we can see that this is literally my phone screen and we can see it's really really smooth a uh, USB connection is honestly the best way to go if you're looking for delay free uh, super smooth but we can see right here we got my TikTok for you page and the audio works as well we got some random different stuff here uh, but yeah this is pretty much the software itself all right and another really cool feature that the software offers is the ability to directly record in software so you can literally press this record button it'll give like countdown and then what we can do is like i can go to my tiktok right here and we can see this is just like my tiktok and then i can stop it open the folder and just like that we actually have a recording of our screen here so this is actually a really good way to get like footage for youtube videos or something like that if you really needed to um obviously if we wanted to we could make we could li directly live stream it we can make it full screen but yeah guys there's really not a lot to it it's just a basic screen mirroring software and you know just having it be functional is like the best thing ever. And just to end the video off, it's only right that we pull up my YouTube channel. Uh, but yeah, if you guys did enjoy, go check out this software. It's gonna be the first thing in the description. Great software. Definitely my favorite mirroring software on the internet, like 100%. There's like no delay. I just don't understand how it does it. It's great. I love it. I'm gonna be using it to get footage for my own YouTube videos. If I need to show the perspective of someone on their phone, or even if I need to record footage for TikTok of different like screen things, like for example, like scrolling on TikTok, and I need to record something like that, I'm gonna do that. It's a great software. I highly recommend that you go pick it up. So go do that. First link in the description, like, comment, subscribe. Massive shout out to people over at iMyPhone for actually allowing me to check this out for you guys.